XXL Oglo fam, Vince here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. And I think nag wonder kayo kung bakit ako nakaprobinsya ng outfit. Magtais ganda muna tayo kahit napaka-init ng panahon ngayon. At since malapit na yung Halloween, gagawin na natin yung very first ever Halloween makeup tutorial glam dito sa YouTube channel ko. In today's video, gagawa tayo ng goth-inspired, vampire-ish, red and black fusion na Halloween glam. Isa ata ito sa napakadaling makeup glam na pwedeng gawin kung aaten kayo ng Halloween party. This look would definitely work para sa lahat ng genders out there. Sigurado ako dun. At pag sinabi ko sa inyong napakadali lang, as in napakadali lang. If you wanna see me do this glam, ano pang hinihintay niya, mag-subscribe na kayo sa channel ko, XXOO Vince. You can follow me on my social media accounts. Everything will be up here and linked down below. I upload videos every Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And meron din tayong pakaraoke videos on the weekends. If you're buying any of the products used in this video, don't forget to tag me on Instagram at xxoovince with the hashtag Vince made me buy this. Don't forget to click the bell notification icon so that you will be updated every time I upload a brand new video. So glow fam, ano pang hinihintay natin? Without further ado, let's glow. Bago pa magsimula yung video na to, naglagay na ako ng Bello Sun Expert Perfecting Shield Tinted Sunscreen. Ito meron daw tong Tone Adapt Technology, so allegedly dapat mag-work to sa lahat ng mga skin tones. It says here na meron tong SPF 50 and PA++++ Tone Adapt Technology Cell Protect. It's paraben-free, non-comedogenic, hyperallergenic, dermatologist tested, and it's certified halal. This is one of my favorite products, go-to products ko to pag gusto ko ma-achieve yung mga parang no makeup makeup day. So ito lang, tapos maglalagay lang ako ng konting-konting contour, blush, highlight, then yun yun. Saktong-sakto to kasi napaka-init ng panahon ngayon at naka-leather jacket ako, magtiis ganda tayo para sa look na to. Hindi ko alam kung magpapas ko na ba o bumalik ulit sa summer, naguguluhan na talaga ako sa panahon ngayon. So anyways, before anything else, magpa-prime na tayo ng face first using the Lux Organics Rose Water Glow Mist. Medyo recently ko lang to na-discover, pero simula nung day na ginamit ko siya, I love it. <sighs> Ngayon na medyo nag-set sa face yung glow mist natin. Next up, we'll be using my all-time favorite, the Caroline Blur Stick. Now, we apply lang natin yung Caroline Blur Stick sa face natin kung saan super prominent yung mga pores. We all love healthy looking, poreless, glowing skin. But then again, meron pa rin ako mga blemishes sa mukha na gusto kong itago, like yung pimple na to. Tapos meron akong itch dito na medyo mapula pa siya. I definitely need some coverage. For foundation today, I'm using the Dermacol Film Studio Makeup Cover in the shade 223. I like putting my foundation by portions muna. Gusto ko nakalapat muna siya sa face. Tapos later na lang tayo magbe-blend out. Now using the clean side of the sponge, let's blend. For concealer, I'm using the Maybelline New York Fit Me Concealer in the shade Medium. Using the same sponge na ginamit natin for foundation, i blend lang natin yung concealer. To set the face, I'm using the Cody Airspun Loose Face Powder in the shade Translucent with extra coverage. Let's use the same damp sponge para mas magsink in yung powder sa skin natin. Now using my BTLA powder brush, we'll just remove the excess powder. And now it's time to bake. Using the same powder brush, tanggalin lang natin yung sa forehead to get ready for the brows. For brows, I'm using Brows on Fleek and I'm in the shade Dark Brown. First, I brush muna natin yung brows natin using a spoolie. Then now, mag-focus muna tayo sa outline ng brows. Once the outline is done, I fill in lang natin yung brows and whatever's left in sa brush, I focus natin dun sa inner brow portion to get the gradient effect. Now I'm using the EB Advance Eyebrow Kit. On this brow kit, we'll wax. 
Let's apply the wax to the brows. Tapos, i-brush natin siya ng spoolie to get the desired shape. Now it's time to remove the bake. Of course, bago tayo pumunta sa eyeshadow look, since different color yung gagamitin natin pang contour and pang blush, it's better pa rin na merong foundation yung different color na yun. For contour, I'm using the Vice Cosmetics Out of Contour in the shade For Sure. Using my contour brush, kuha lang tayo ng product. I like stippling the contour brush first para hindi masyadong harsh yung contour natin agad-agad. Now for the nose contour, I'm just using a different brush. Now that we look all snatched and chiseled up, for blush I'm using Vice Cosmetics Out of Blush in the shade Title. Using my Gosh Blusher 009 brush, ko lang tayo ng product. Then using the Luna Organic Skin Mattifying Mist, mag spray lang tayo para hindi tayo sobrang dry. <sighs> sobrang bango. Of course, for today, gagamitin natin tong favorite palette ko so far, yung Glam Eyeshadow Palette from Glam Skin Manila. Again, I really think that this palette would be perfect sa lahat ng mga Halloween glam na gagawin nyo. Because of all these colorful shades na meron tong palette to, sobrang daming looks and sobra sobrang daming options sa pwede nyo gawin. Now that you're all zoomed in at dahil nga winged eyeliner yung gagawin natin today, hindi mawawala ang powerful tape. <laughs> To prime the lids, I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade Medium. Maglalagay tayo ng setting powder dito sa under eyes natin, pang salo ng mga fallout, pang salo ng mga na-fall. Kasi di ba masakit pag na-fall ka tapos walang sumalo sa'yo? Masakit di ba? So agad-agad, we're dipping into the shade Poet. I-focus lang natin yung Poet dun sa regular crease natin, and then later on, i-extend na rin natin siya hanggang sa wing. Next, using a blending brush, is a smoke out natin tong nilapat natin na poet. Just focus on the harsh lines dun sa poet and make sure to smoke it out kasi konting konti lang yung gagamitin natin shades to create this eye look. Now that poet is all smoked out, we'll dip into the shade party. With light scratches ng brush, dahan-dahan kong ina-apply yung pigment dun sa smoked out portion ng poet. Using my finger, I'm dipping into the shade Queen. I-apply natin yung Queen on the inner corner. And ilagay na rin natin siya just right under our brow bone. We'll just remove any excess powders. For the lower lash line, kuha lang tayo ng poet. Be very careful na huwag masyadong malapad yung paglapat nyo ng poet dun sa lower lash line kung ayaw nyo magbukang sinapak. Then, let's get party. Make sure to connect party dun sa poet to complete the lower lash line. Then, just get a small brush to smoke everything out. Using a precise brush, let's make sure to smoke everything out, but dahan-dahan nga, ayaw natin magmukhang sinapa. And that is one eye all done. I'm just gonna do the other eye off camera and we'll be back. Now that both eyes are all done, naglagin na rin ako ng mascara and some lashes. Now it's time to finish off the eyes. So, magta-tight line tayo. I'm using the EB Advance Eye Define Waterproof Matic Eyeliner. Sobrang ganda nitong eyeliner na to. I highly recommend this product and ginagamit ko siya palagi pang tight line ko. Now, hindi pa dyan nagtatapos yung tutorial natin. As you can see, nireinforce ko yung blush and yung contour natin and medyo tinapangan ko ng konti yung contour kasi gagawa tayo ng isa pang contour na iba yung kulay. So, using a bigger brush, we're dipping into the shade Party. Make sure to stipple party first dun sa skin natin. Mamaya na tayo mag-blend. We just wanted to make sure na makukuha natin yung desired shape natin dun sa bright red color na to.
stop us using another brush, let's make sure that everything is smoked out. Lagyan natin ng konting konting deeper tone yung red na nilagay natin. So, using powet. Be very careful na huwag masyadong maraming powet yung ilalagay nyo kasi magiging mahirap na siya i-blend kapag pinagpatong-patong nyo pa yung kulay. So, every now and then, I make sure na nire-reinforce ko yung party shade para maganda yung gradient effect niya. And now for the lips. I'm going to line my lips first using face paint and we're dipping into the shade black. Apparently, hindi ako masyadong nasatisfy dun sa pagka-black ng face paint na nilagay ko sa lips. So, later on, makikita nyo, maglalagay ako ng mas deeper black color gamit yung gel liner ko. Then, patungan natin ang EB Matte Liquid Lipstick in the shade Fierce Red. Then, of course, hindi matatapos tong look na to nang hindi tayo nag-highlight using the EB Advance Glow Out Highlighter in the shade Strobe. Grabe, I went ham nung nag-highlight na ako dito. Since this is a Halloween glam, hindi naman siya regular glam, you can definitely exaggerate your highlight para pop na pop yung high points ng face nyo. And that's it! Naglagay na rin ako ng stones dito and one dun sa lip ko for added drama. To finish off the look, iset na natin siya using the Lux Organic Skin Mattifying Mist. <sighs> and this is the look all done! That's it for today's video guys. Thank you so much for watching. Today's XXOO shoutout goes to... Grace! Si Grace ay isa sa mga colleagues ko when I was in Dubai. And napakabait na itong taong to. Though minsan may pagkamakulit, medyo pasaway. Pero alam mong maaasahan mo talaga pagdating sa trabaho. Higit sa lahat, kahit hindi na ako boss ni Grace, patuloy pa rin yung suporta niya sa akin. Lalo na nung nagsimula ako ng YouTube channel na to. Sobrang lahat ng videos pinapanood niya. Meron siyang mga suggestions. Meron siyang mga requests. And nakakatawa yun for me. No? Overwhelm mo kapag may mga ganong klaseng tao. So salamat Grace. Wala kang idea kung gano'n ako na-overwhelm. Lalo na pag may mga positive comments or suggestions ng kagaya mo. Sobrang ko na-appreciate yun. So Grace, I miss you. I hope na okay ka, pati yung team. And wala akong ibang masabi kundi mag-ingat kayo dyan sa Dubai and pagbutihin nyo pa yung trabaho. Thank you so much, Grace. Mwah. Now, if you want to be the next XXOO shoutout, don't forget to follow me on all my social media accounts up here, and everything will be linked down below. And leave a comment on this video with the hashtag XXOO shoutout. Again, if you're buying any of the products used in this video, don't forget to tag me on Instagram at XXOOVince with the hashtag Vince made me buy this. Kung meron pa kayo mga suggestions ng Halloween looks na gusto nyong i-recreate ko, sound off down below. Basta kaya ko, itatry ko talaga. Promise. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I love you guys so much. XXOO Glow Fam. And I'll see you on the next one.